Pierce Anderson, and this um, this uh, furious young woman here is Gillian Tunney. Uh, together, we are working on a very interesting project involving three-dimensional avatars in the browser. And uh, today, I'm just going to talk to you a little bit about it. The, the presentation is called "Beautiful Ones." Um, I named it that because I just happen to own the most beautiful avatar in all the world. Um, this is this is Pierce P. He was born inside the virtual world of Second Life in 2004, and um, unfortunately, he got mugged in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, and uh, on the 4th of July a couple of years ago. So that explains the uh, the eye there. Um, but he is an avatar that I, I love dearly. You want to say anything, Pierce? Excellent. Um, so yeah, so he's, he's a living creature. Today, I want to talk about. First of all, why uh, avatars matter. Um, one of the reasons why they matter is, is just the fact that, you know, there's just so many reasons. I mean, everybody has a different reason for loving and appreciating their avatar. It's a, it's a very personal thing. Um, because of the fact that self-actualization is involved, you know, some people decide that they want to create a version of themselves that, that's kind of like an ideal self, and other people do something that's a little more different. Um, it's a very elegant means of expression because it has built upon millions of years of evolution. You have uh, body language, emotion, and uh, my favorite, fashion. Uh, they, all, they all kind of mix together into, um, into one little nice 3D package. So what we're trying to do uh, is, number one, we're trying to streamline the process of um, viewing avatars on on the browser, and uh, one of the ways we're doing that is, is we're trying to, to create this uh, kind of like a middle layer uh, of code that's kind of like a, a markup language, we call it AVML, and uh, it, it kind of provides a bridge between the textures and the 3D model itself. We also want to produce tools that make the whole process of uh, designing avatars you know, very uh, efficient. And uh, one of those tools I'm going to be showing and demoing today, um, and uh, we're going to pull it up right here. Here's P he is getting into place. And uh, I'm going to pull up the editor here. Okay, so this is uh, this is the model. Sometimes you, you may not want to be a man. Um, and so today, let's say I decide well, I want to be a girl. So there we go. Uh, I've just transformed my avatar into a, a, a beautiful female there. And, um, but you know what? I, I really like being a man, so let's go back. Uh, so um, let's see. Today, you know, the thing about avatars is, is you kind of you kind of always want to be able to customize it. You always want to be able to change it. I think I'm just going to go with you know like some regular skin today. And uh, you know what? Um, how about some freckles to um, add it? That will be that will be fantastic. Um, I'm feeling a little tomboyish. So uh, let's get that going. And uh, you know, I want to I want to bring out the uh, the darker side that's inside of me. So let's throw some um, some eyeliner on that. And uh, the thing is, I think the skin is just a little too bright. Um, I think I want to to make it a little paler. Um, you know, I really enjoy creating my avatar. I just want to get it completely perfect. So let's let's uh, lower the saturation down a little bit. And uh, get it a, a little lighter. And you know what? I think it needs to be a little brighter too. So we're creating like all these all these different um, ways of manipulating color, uh, manip manipulating the texture um, inside the browser so that you can kind of create the, uh, the avatar exactly like you want it. Uh, I think I might, uh, in this model, I think I'm going to try to change the color of the eyes here. So now I'm, I'm shifting the hue of the eyes and uh, making it a little more green. So, uh, so yeah, once you once you, you figure out uh, what avatar you want, um, in this demo I'm gonna I'm gonna undo everything, and uh, then I'm going to uh, to save it. Uh, and we have a, a backend system that, that keeps track of, of all the filters and all the textures, and uh, all the uh, the models themselves. And I'm gonna save it, and then it'll it'll be displayed there uh, for uh, for anyone to see. It has a it has a browser. Um, and uh, the flash player installed. So, uh, so yeah, that's. Uh, we thank you for uh, five minutes of fame. Uh, it was fantastic. Uh, thanks for allowing us to do this. And uh, that's it.